Welcome ABC networking community. My name is Tobias Veninge and in this video I want to show you a cool new feature on the Aruba user experience insight sensors named web application testing. I'm not sure if you are aware but if you are on the UXI dashboard as we are right now and you want to see what kind of functionality has been added you just go to these three dots you click and you say what's new. And on here you can see there has been added testing, throughput, latency and jitter with LibraSpeed in August. Maybe that's something for a new video. And here you can see the web application testing that has been added in July 14, 2021. And if you click on this, you got, you've been taken to a help page. And on this help page you can see um, an explanation of the functionality, how to install it on your own desktop, start with the first recording and what kind of features and functionalities of the Selenium IDA that we are going to use to record the web application testing. But for this one, let's close this off because we are going to do this on ourselves. And I'm on Firefox. You can also use Chrome, for example. But if you want to install the Selenium uh, add-on, you click on add-ons in the tools menu. And you can see here Selenium IDE has been installed and enabled on my side. But if, uh, if you don't have it installed, you just search for it you'll be taken to a search page and then you can click it here and install it so that's all being said and we are ready to record our first web application test but what's the use case on the uxi sensors there is a lot of internal and a lot of external tests like salesforce uh, you know facebook skype for business zoom tests that making sure is how the users are perceiving the networking infrastructures and the more uxi sensors you have throughout your infrastructure the better statistics and the better view you get in how users devices are perceiving the networking infrastructure but there is always applications that maybe you want to test on your own there is a web application that you want to see if i click you know, one, two, three, what is happening and how is that being perceived by the, by, the, by, the, by the user and what is the time. So in order to do that, we now give you the opportunity to create these custom web applications. I'm going to read, record for this, this demo a very simple uh, setup, but that's where you can, you can verify how you can make it more complex in your environment. So what we do first, if we go to the Selenium add-on, let me get this here for you you can see selenium we're going to record a new test in a new project the project name will be abc networking oh. then we do okay the base url www.arubanetworks.com that's the base url where we're going to uh, to work from so if I now click start reader and you get it start recording you get an additional screen and that will go to Aruba networks.com and from there it will record everything we do so let me start recording let me resize a little bit I want to have have it a little bit bigger and I want to know more about the Texas Rangers how Aruba has been delivering a fan experience for them so let me find out uh, found out how and that's opening a new screen I get to a block base. So that's for me is enough for this particular uh, web application testing. I said you can, you can make more complex one on your own. So let me stop the recording. Now I need to save uh, a name for this new test. Let's call it ABCN. Okay. And now you can see what is happening. It opened up the screen. It sets a window size because we have been resizing it. And then it clicks on a certain button which, which took us to another screen of the Texas Rangers. So I will save this project. Let me just save it on the, uh, on the dashboard. It will be safe with the dot site extension. Now what we need to do is we need to go back into the, into our dashboard of the Aruba user experience inside. So we click here as we go to settings and we need to go to service and application testing because we need to add a specific test, add test select custom then we select web application testing uh, that was on the dashboard we select the file here we can select the frequency testing so now once every five minutes it will start running this test and running the sequence of steps i did 
and then shows us the uh, the results let me click add it's now been uh, added abc networking it is also running um, so what we now need to do is wait so you can see that is added to the list of external tests we don't have a results yet so what i want to do is i want to go back to the block article click to the web application testing again and show you a little bit what is happening here if something is going wrong so here you have an example where they have been adding a web application testing here you can see the results over time uh, constantly when it runs so yeah and you can see exactly the commands open window size what time it takes for the user to uh, to do this and if it enters an error it will go in a diagnose mode which we are calling a triage mode on the aruba uxi and in that mode it will run a certain predefined troubleshooting test to make sure that you can quickly get to the root cause of the test failure and you can see an example of that one here okay so let me now move back and see if there's already one test being run um, and then let's let's look at the results of this particular test we don't have a test yet so let's give it a couple of seconds before we get the first results we have been fast forwarding time a little bit because remember the test is runs uh, once every five minutes and we had to wait a couple of minutes before we get the first results in but here we go we have the first results in on the status it's now good you can see the total elapsed time you can even uh, see it per sensor for example and you can see the specific task this is how easy it is to set up customized uxi test for web application to make sure that for your infrastructure you can always measure how the users are perceiving the networking infrastructure for all the applications that are automatically embedded within the uxi sensor but now also set it up for customized web application thank you very much if you like the video please do a thumbs up if you have any questions or comments please leave them in the comments field thank you very much and hope to get you in the next video bye bye